How's it? Today is November 29th. It's Monday. Today is a snatch day. Um, I'm going home tomorrow. So, I'm not sure actually how my training will be tomorrow. We'll see what I can do, what I can fit in. It seems like I'm going to be able to lift tomorrow morning. In any case, today's goal was to hit a complex of snatch plus two hang snatch at 90. 90 seems to be that magical number right when things start to fall apart um, I've said it tons of times in the past but 90 is the number where I, I can miss 7 out of 8 attempts on a single day and um, for no good reason other than me miss executing because I think I'm strong enough to almost power snatch this so if if that's how I feel on certain days, me missing is is completely all in my head. It's not due to me being too weak or me being sore or what have you. It's just my inability to execute. Today was not like that. Today I actually did my one plus two at ninety. Um, the first time I did it was the first set. And that's a PR. Uh, I've never done 90 for a triple um, from any position, and you know I've been saying from any position quite often lately because I've been doing a lot of complexes where the hang snatch is a part of the complex, but it's not necessarily the whole. Like I think a hang snatch does not equal uh, a snatch from the floor, so that means that's just like. It's a little bit easier to do. However, I've never done three. So three from a hang snatch, three from a block, one plus two, two plus one, any of those, any combination of anything. I've never done three snatches at 90 in a single set. So getting today to do them today was pretty big for me. I didn't miss at all today. So that's a huge win. I think that there is some some of it to do with the mental reset of coming home I don't think I'm doing anything particularly spectacular or different than what I was when I was lifting in California I just think that maybe I, I'm a little more refreshed and looking forward to training same thing happened on Friday right I, I made 10 for 10 so here's my first set all of these on the bottom are going to say PR because technically, yeah, as I mentioned, never hit a triple from any position. Some of them aren't the greatest, like that one. But again, it's, it's a PR, so PR is a PR. Generally, extremely happy with it, with it. I think one thing that I'm trying to focus on here, I, I mean, it's been true for a while, but for these hangs, to make sure that I don't rock on my feet, keep my feet planted firmly on the ground. And I think that that small cue, that small change is enough to elicit consistency from me, especially from the hang. I, I'm still trying to figure out how to do it from the floor. But from the hang, it's just, everything just seems so much easier than it used to be. And here's the last rep, you know, all of the ninth rep out of all of nine. And it's, you know, like when it gets to that point, it, there's a, a lot of pressure. <laughs> Moses, yeah, he was clapping for me over there. So I told him that this is a PR, and if I was able to get through them all, then that's a huge volume PR overall. And uh, anyone who's been around fitness for long enough or weightlifting training and things like that know what a PR means. And um, yeah, like I, I don't come by those very often. So I'm very happy with it. After that, I moved into some banded snatch deadlifts. These were a little bit challenging. Something that kind of got worse over the weekend was my my back my my lower back 
on the right side of my lower back, it started to feel a little bit achy. It largely happened, uh, I think, from Saturday after the, sorry, on Friday, I think after the uh, GHD sit-ups, because it feels like they crunched my lower back. It didn't feel too bad when I was lifting yesterday, sorry, Saturday. Uh, and yesterday, uh, Sunday, it was uh, not a fun time. So I did go on a walk yesterday, like a, like a two-mile walk. I was trying to go for a two-mile walk, and then it started raining. But uh, during that walk, it started to loosen up and felt a lot better. So I, I don't think it's a too big an issue, and I think that it will go away very shortly. I hope that tomorrow on the plane, it's not a big issue. Uh, it might be. I have no idea. But for the time being, you know, just trying to be a little bit smart about what I'm doing. So after those banded snatch deadlifts, I moved into my push press plus overhead squat. Goal was to just hit 120 for a 2 plus 1. I think my best at 120, I think it's a 3 plus 1. I think I've done that in the past. But I don't think that, at least when I started doing these today, they didn't feel super challenging and they didn't feel like I was struggling at all. So I am pretty happy with how training has been going at least for this this aspect this is 110 and then 120 is my next one I think the most difficult part about these is just catching the weight <laughs> oh, didn't have enough leg drive there but I'm able to hold on and, and push out of the hole pretty easily. I can see right here. That's my triceps tightening up and uh, cramping. Not not me trying to flex. It's me trying to stretch my triceps. Um, after that, I did some pull-ups and some uh, hanging leg raises for my abs today because I didn't want to do the GHD sit-ups to potentially mess up my back. But yeah, that's it for today. Going home tomorrow, going back to California, I should say. Uh, thank you for watching. Shoots.